Come on, give me a nice bow. And higher. Higher. Uh, is it high enough? Bend the knees. Now find your balance, boy. Find your balance, boy. Don't oh, know. Oh. <sighs> Guys, it's the 21st century. The curtsy is dead. Huh? How about we practice something that I like to do instead, uh. like dancing? Mm. Too. Come on, Snow, with me. Ah! A classic. Right? <laughs> Congratulations. <laughs> You're just like your great, 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 Oh, yes, uh, her great-great-grandmother, always with the singing and dancing, always giving the courtesy lessons. But one day you'll be queen, just like her ancestor Snow White. And you'll see, it isn't all singing and dancing. Queen of what? Besides, I'm going to be a vet and save emperor penguins in Antarctica. Oh, wonderful. A queen should know how to greet an emperor. Let's practice. Uh, uh, no, I said penguins. Emperor penguins. Emperors nonetheless. In fact, if you meet a lion, you need to know the protocol for greeting the king of the jungle. Otherwise, you might get devoured. And what if I meet the queen of ants? Well, I do know about the queen of pants. Very strange kingdom. But the queen of ants? Hmm. I think I need to do research. I will be right back. <sighs> Let's dance. Let's party. <laughs> All night long. <laughs> My new masterpiece. Revolutionary yet super simple. <laughs> A new invention? Science inspired me yet again. Behold, my new teleportation machine. Get from point A to point B without taking a single step. Oh, teleport me to Snow's room. Hmm. My first guinea pig. <laughs> Enter the machine, my young friend. You'll be there in two ticks. <laughs> uh, that ball you just test teleported is nowhere to be found. Gone! Uh, Disappeared! Uh, into the ether! Uh, what? 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 Ingenio? What did he say? <laughs> His teleporting machine is actually a magic trash can. Throw stuff into it, and whoosh! It's gone! Forever! Uh, uh, help! 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 Snow! Uh, help! What is going on? Uh, uh, trying to make me disappear with his teleporting uh. trash can. Ingenio, you promised you wouldn't use your brothers as guinea pigs. But he volunteered so nicely. He wanted to do his part for science. How can I refuse? Mm -mm. You forced me to be harsh with you. You are now forbidden to teleport anything. And you're grounded. No inventions for the next ten days. <laughs> you're an enemy to progress. No, come and clean the table now. Okay, what is that? Huh. I can't. Mr. Olof gave me additional homework to do. Any guesses why? No. Talking in class? Back talk? Refusing to talk? Well, it's gotta be something like that. Mm. No, 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 no. Don't do that. Otherwise, she will never learn. Snow, get down here immediately and clear the table. Oh. Just a minute. Huge essay to write. I have to finish it before I turn 21. It's just being silly now. What are you doing? I'm writing her that I just baked a super premium triple chocolate chocolate cake so she'll come right away. <sighs> Send. Triple chocolate? Yahoo! I'm coming! Winner Marco. Now it's style. They trick me again. Do this. Do that. Don't do this. Don't do that. Ugh. I'm tired of being told what to do, what not to do, and what I should have done. You should live with Brania. I do. Oh, yeah. You know what I need? Donut? No. All I need is one day where I give all the orders and everyone has to obey me. Yeah, you could order me to eat a donut. Don't even think about it. I was just asking. I know, let's play Snow is Queen. Yay, Snow is the Queen. But there's
there's no kingdom left. I'll never be a queen. Incorrect. As the royal heir, you have the right and duty to be acting queen for one day a year. Think of it as a royal internship. Here's the proof in the story of Snow White and her <sighs> kingdom. So I get to be queen for one whole day? As Bradia would say, those are the rules. <laughs> I get to be queen! I get to be queen! Oh. My loyal subjects! We have to catch up. How? When? How about tomorrow? So my parents will never agree. Don't worry, Snow. It's our duty to help you. <laughs> oh. My sweet loyal subjects! So, boss, what do you reckon, boss? Huh, boss? We figured that only our great leader, Brainio, would be able to convince Marco and Blanche. <laughs> <laughs> well, that is very kind of you, but, um, no. It's way too soon for Snow to be queen this year, let alone tomorrow, as you suggested. Even if it's only for practice, there's etiquette. The invitations must be sent out for the coronation, preparations made. With all that, I'll never have time to trim my beard for tomorrow. But, boss... You don't need to call him boss anymore. He said no. Why would you refuse a queen the chance to practice her power? Who do you think you are, the king? Uh, Only a king would fear not being in command for just uh, one day. Oh. Hmm. Oh, not at all. No power is no trifle, and it can make you get carried away. I just don't think Snow is ready. Next year, perhaps. But she should have ruled once a year, since she turned eight. That's what the book says. When did you stop respecting the law? Fine. I'll plead in favor of Snow being queen for tomorrow. Yeah! Huh? It's my duty as boss, after all. You know how important it is for a child to have her own personal experiences, whether positive or negative. Mm -hmm. And being queen for a day is a fun and educational activity which will do a world of good to Snow. Okay, uh, I get it. <laughs> Snow will be queen for a day tomorrow. Yes. Everything will be fine. <laughs> All right then. So, Snow will be queen for a day tomorrow. Huh? Huh? Queen, queen, Snow, queen. go straight to bed. Ooh. Is it midnight? No. Ask the future queen's mother, I'm still in charge until the clock strikes 12. Oh. What's all this? Have some respect, please. The queen is about to grace us with a royal presence. Are you kidding me? Shh. You promised. Look. Royal Stumble of the Future Queen. As the master of this ceremony, I bid Lord Marco to give Queen Snow her scepter. My scepter? Here is the scepter, Your Highness. Oh. Who's that bunny? It's the one I used to tell her stories with when she was little. I loved it. Can we do that again? Well, your wishes are my command, Your Grace. And after, would you please clean up all my royally dirty socks? Blanche, the crown. May your rule be sound and solid. And may you very quickly learn not to abuse your power. So that your humble servant start calling you Snow Wise. <laughs> You're funny. And you should go in my dungeons for doubting me. But since you're my mother, I reluctantly forgive you. Do you have anything to say to your royal highness? It's gonna be a long day. <laughs> your highness. One, two, three. Long live Queen Snow! Hooray! Go and fetch my royal popcorn princely sweets and imperial juice. I have some serious TV to watch. 
Your wishes are our command. And while we're at it, Mysterio. Your Majesty. You are now my favorite counselor. Is that true? And you are in full power. But I'm your counselor. Well, out with the old and in with the new. <laughs> Mysterio, grant each of our subjects one wish. Hooray! Long live Her Majesty! I found it! You know, it's crucial for the queen to be well fed. If she doesn't eat well, she won't be able to rule properly, so... Granted, donuts for every <laughs> meal. <laughs> <laughs> Great, thank you. <laughs> yeah. Next. I want to invent a robot that will do our work in the mine. Brainio is against this uh -huh. idea. Work is healthy, as he always says, uh -huh. but I say using a robot is good for you. <laughs> Good idea. You shall invent a robot. Because of this darn road work, all the cars are passing by outside our windows. So find a solution to reduce this noise. Affirmative. Ingenio, what's going on? I told you not to invent anything for ten days. Uh, uh, mm -hmm. Ah, uh, the contrary. My robot is already mm -hmm. invented. Mm -hmm. This is just a test. A very elaborate, inventive test. No, no, no. Uh, Don't apologize to this phony. <laughs> You're not in charge today, uh, Bradio. Uh, you have no right to issue commands. <laughs> I'm the Queen's personal counselor. Uh, I have all the rights. <laughs> you manipulated us in order to seize the power. I'm going to tell everyone, Mysterio, you will be punished for this. What did you do to Brainio? I teleported him, obviously. <laughs> Don't you ever listen? The machine doesn't work. Now Brainio is lost in space, and we're Snow White and the Six Dwarves. Way to go. Oh, malditos de malditas. Not a word to anyone until we've found Brainio. You repair the machine. I'll look for a spell to bring him back. No one will ever know. Hello? <laughs> a funny joke, you guys. Now get me out of here. Hello? Oh, Ingenio! Uh, we're making deliveries. Your father is loading up the van, and I'll see you later. Sweet Highness. Sweet Royal Highness. Is your sweet Royal Highness really going to spend her entire royal day watching TV? Doesn't she have songs to sing and dances to dance? And dreams to dream? I thought I was the one giving orders today. Oh, it's not an order. It's, it's just a suggestion. A, uh, a firm suggestion. You and Daddy come home as late as you possibly can. And that's a royal order. It has a nuclear engine with double reverse camshaft, which will give it incredible power. Oh. Are you sure it's going to not work? Do you either. doubt my creation? Well, you almost sent me to nowhere land with your magic trash bin. No! Oh. You mean my highly sophisticated teleporting machine. Whatever you call it. Brainio saved my skin, and where is he anyway? Uh, Snow made him a special ambassador. He's paying a royal visit to Mademoiselle Zuzu, the <gasps> queen next door. Mm. <laughs> ah, got it. <laughs> Brainio will be back soon. <laughs> Oh, oh, finally! Snow's concert is beginning! <laughs> I'd like to dedicate this song to one of my loyal subjects, Cuddlyo. Oh, me? Never change, buddy. Oh, uh -huh. <laughs> oh, 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 oh.
what you know is all about what you say is all about love what you know is all about what you say it's all about love <laughs> Ubata. Trick. Fox. Fox. This is... That's all right. Radio? Are you there? Okay, moving on. Tway goes away. The Filio! Multi-dusty, multi I think I made a mistake. <laughs> Good thing no one was here to see it. <laughs> oh, what now? These people drive me crazy. Camilla, what is going... What is all that music? It's coming from the White House? Right. I'll be right there. Thank you. Thank you all. <laughs> hey, where have you been, Beefio? You're missing all the royal fun. The kingdom and our queen are now safe. I put up no entry signs everywhere. Perimeter is checked and secured. Willie, my humble servant, how nice of you to come by and pay your respects. I'm queen today. And you celebrated the crowning without me? Mm-hmm. Kiss my hand. No. No, I don't think so. <sighs> really? I can't lower myself to open the door. It's unroyal. You serious? I'm supposed to be a modern queen? Is this a rebelling or No, your highness. It's a revolution! <sighs> Commoners. Hey, Miss B. The whole area is now a one-way zone. It's the worst traffic jam ever. Marco is still in the car and I had to walk back here. Before realizing, I forgot the keys in the car. Other than that, it's wonderful. She's pretty when she's angry. Excuse me? Nothing. Hey, Mrs. B. Why does Mel say she's the queen? Oh, it's not for much longer, Willie. Matter of fact, it's only seven hours, 48 minutes, and nine seconds. She's no fun as queen. I'll be back in seven hours, 49 minutes, and 10 seconds. My beautiful streets are a mess. Cars are everywhere, and I'm sure it's got something to do with you. And the fireworks, and the noises, and the music. This better stop immediately. Or she's going to call the police. Please? The army. Everything is going to be fine, okay? Start timing. In five minutes, it will be quiet. It had better be. Yes. What was that? Just the, the washing machine downstairs. Spin cycle. Everything is going to be fine. You have five minutes. Genio's new invention. We can't control it. Gilfo and I are trying to stop it. Oh, I missed it. Stop it! Is. I missed it. Go oh, behind you. Help me! <laughs> I did it. I conquered the robot. Ha, we did it. We're the best. No, no, and no. You made your queen very disappointed. But we had to protect the kingdom. No. Oh, it's all over. I don't want to be queen. I've had it. It's too hard. I don't care what potion you make or what inventions it takes, but you better clean this mess up. Potion? Oh, yes, whatever you say, you're a boss, uh, yeah. Thank you for a lovely afternoon in the city's garbage truck. It was enlightening. <sighs> I'm not hungry. Honey, don't be sad. I was an awful queen, wasn't I? Maybe a little young. Here, I think it needs a hug. Who was an awful queen today? 
Yeah, me. Oh, I think he has some visitors. May I come in? If not, I'll come by again next week. Mysterio, go in. Uh, uh, we come in? Hey, uh. Come on in. Uh. Even you, Mysterio. Come on. As your personal counselor, your highness, I'd like to apologize on behalf of your subjects. And? And what? Uh, I've said it all. And? Uh, I'm sorry I sent uh, Brainio, our leader, into the garbage truck. Uh, <laughs> no, I apologize for being such an awful queen. And it, I must admit, I'm not ready to rule yet, but Benny is. <laughs> Honey, it's very honorable of you to admit that. <laughs> I'm sorry, Brainio, if I've made you sad. These are tears of joy, Your Majesty. Huh? Wait, we aren't ready. Oh, yeah. <laughs> We're ready now. You can start. After her first day as queen, Snow White went to find her loyal friend and advisor, Brainio, <laughs> and said, Oh, Brainio, I'm sorry I was such an awful queen. I must admit, I'm not ready to rule yet. Hey, she said the same thing. Oh, so is it a tradition? You'll be a wonderful queen, my child, but later... Long live the future <laughs> Snow Queen! We're so proud of you. So beautiful. Oh. Uh, it's almost midnight. All right. Everything is going to disappear. One. Two. Three. <sighs> Married Snow White, not Cinderella.